Kelly, I'm team lead and these are the Dastardly Scientists. Uh, today we'll be telling you a little bit about the team and introducing a game and uh, over the coming weeks we'll be detailing our production of the game here at Goldsmiths University. Okay, I'm going to move on and introduce you to the rest of the people. Beside me here we have Buffy Boja, she's our audio engineer. Say hello Buffy. Hello. Hi Dom. Um, hello. What do you do on our team? I'm a uh... Artistic director and in charge of, sort of 2D concept art as well as textures and all that stuff. And you've been doing for us today? Today I'm working on animated textures, just getting something in uh, done in formats that I can send over to the programmers and they can put it in the engine and see if it works. And this is Simon. Simon, uh, what do you do on the team? Uh, hello, my name's Simon. I am the junior programmer on the team, or second programmer as it is. And uh, I'm basically currently working on the code for the game. Um, physics engines, gravity systems, orbits for planets around other objects. And uh, yeah, it's all going really well. So what specific tasks are you tackling this week? Um, specifically, I'm working on orbit rotations using um, translation mathematics so that we can have the planets orbiting around one another because since it's a solar system we need elliptical and circular orbits. And this is Luke Bunnyface. Luke, could you tell us what you do on the team? Uh, I'm the lead programmer for the Dastardly Scientists. Um, I'm currently yeah. working on the input code and for, as you know, the game's full play. All right. And uh, I'm just bashing that code out basically. Okay, so then we've uh, told you a little bit about the game, here we are. Um, we're going to uh, tell you a little bit about the game. Planet Panic is a party-based game for the Xbox for two to four players. It's designed primarily to be played from the couch with your friends, so you can have a good time slacking each other off and betraying each other at critical moments during the game. It's uh, a, an artillery strategy game, which is kind of a little bit along the lines of Scorched Earth or Worms, but our game is played all in real time. We feature a, an amount of really silly and out-there races that you know, and satirise uh, sci-fi tropes and sci-fi culture and pop culture in general with a, an array of very silly weapons that are just shiny and pretty to look at. The game plays fast-paced, quick, short games that uh, hopefully will be action-packed and keep you entertained for quite some time. Okay, thank you very much for listening and we'll talk to you next week.